We're at the National Training Institute, we call it NTI. We did a retention survey last year because we noticed a trend just how many training directors we were losing. And the retention survey gave us an insight into what was really happening with the training directors. The thing I struggled the most with when I first got this job was time management. This job is 100% like drinking water from a fire hose. Most of them, when they come in, they think it's a 40-hour job, and it's actually not that at all. You know, they're running a small university. The biggest challenges would be the roles and the responsibilities that you have to the different organizations that support us, the NECA contractors, the IBW local, uh, and then the apprentice themselves. One day you might be a counselor for an apprentice. Uh, sometimes you might need to be investigating a situation that arises on a job. Someday you might need to be disciplinary. Some, some days you're going to be ordering materials. Basically you got millions of dollars and you got to figure out making sure things are being spent the right way and following it all and it was, it was tough. We, as an industry, need to do a better job of educating and informing the training director applicants of what is included in the job. We decided to deliver classes that will help them overcome some of those obstacles. So new training director development track, all of it's been good. They are enjoying the networking. They find the classes invaluable. Coming to NTI and have somebody that's been in it for a long time, speaking to the newbies and giving us good pointers, that helps a lot. The first day, I took like eight pages of notes, like the nuts and bolts of how this works. There's a lot of moving parts in the apprenticeship. You gotta understand them all. And this has been a, a really good training. We learned about all the policies, what the legal jargon in our policies mean. It's been very, very helpful. We want to make sure that our train directors know that we're here to support them and help them be successful. Having this curriculum for our train directors is all about producing qualified electrical workers. The responsibility that you have to oversee young men and women and really mold them, give them the opportunity to uh, earn a good living and set them on a career path. This is the best job I could have ever have gotten. 